Hello everyone, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use one of the best appointment scheduling platform as we will be looking at how to use Hey Goldie. Hey Goldie is highly rated and beginner friendly as I have used it personally and I know that it is quite handy and it will definitely help to grow your business or services as it will allow your customers or potential customers to easily book an appointment and you'll also be able to automate reminders as this will help to increase your growth and it will also help to cut out those customers that are not certain if they're coming or not. So you'll be able to send them a reminder so if they would like to cancel a booking, they can do that. So this is definitely something that will remove that hassle. You can also use the Hey Goldie platform to collect payments. You'll be able to view reports to see how your business is growing or what you can improve. You can also use it to set up team management and you can use it for marketing. To get started, all you'll need to do is go on to heygoldie.com. After you have done that, you can tap on get started in the top right hand corner. And you can sign up for completely free and see how the platform looks. And if you like it, then you could go onto their paid plan. As you can see right here with their free plan, you will be able to get 20 appointments per month, one user calendar, unlimited devices as you can download their app onto any device, unlimited CRM, online booking, manual reminders, and basic support. Now, if you would like to automate the reminders, you'll need to go up to their paid plan, which starts off at $19.99 per month. And if you would like to add staff members, you can also do that. And that you can see right there is $19.99 per month. And that is the theme package right here. So you could select a theme package if you want. But for this example, I will be using the free plan which you don't need a credit card or anything like that to get started. And once you signed up, you'll be redirected to a dashboard just like this. Now, this dashboard is your calendar and this is how it will look. So from here, you'll be able to see all of the bookings that you have at the moment. And you can also book in a client manually if you want. You could simply do that by tapping on add new in the top right hand corner. And then from there, you could add in the client name, the service that you're going to be offering, and you can add in the location or a message. So for example, if a customer were to call in and say, let's book an appointment, you could do that right there. If you'd like to schedule a personal event to your calendar, you can do that also by tapping on personal event. Now to start setting it up, setting it up what I recommend you do is go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap on the second icon which is right here and you are going to see services. When signing up the service that I chose was barbering which is why you see these templates right here, haircut, beard trim, skin fade or shave but if you offer different services you would have selected something else now to add a service all you'll need to do is tap on add new in the top right hand corner then from there you could tap on add service after you have tapped on add service you can enter your service name so let's say for example i would like to offer a fade so i'll simply type in fade right there then you could type in the description you can select the default service color so you can select whether you want it default or you want to use a different color then you are going to scroll down and you can add your price so let's say for example I want to add a fixed price of $500 by the way if your price fluctuates you can simply tap on variable price then you can add the duration so let's say it will take me 45 minutes I'll select 45 minutes then bookable by clients online i will leave it as is if you want to add staff members you can do that and from there you'll be able to select the staff member name after you have done that you'll simply tap on save in the bottom right hand corner now that i've tapped on save you can see the service at the bottom of the page right here and by the way you can remove a service by simply tapping on the trash can 
to delete a service and if you would like to edit it all you'll need to do is tap on the pencil icon and from there you'll be able to edit the service and you can also see more options right there you could tap right there if you would like to add processing time and so on you can also do that now that you have created your services the next thing you will need to do is go over to the left hand menu option once more and you're going to tap on the third icon by tapping on the third icon you will see all of your clients and you can manually add clients by tapping on add new so right here your assistant could add clients right here or you will see your clients after they have booked a few appointments and you can go over and tap on online booking but to activate online booking if i'm not mistaken this is one of their paid this is one of their paid features but let's see so you can tap right there you can see the services that we'll be offering tap on continue and by the way this is your link that you'll be able to share so you can add your business name right there business description if you would like to add a logo you can tap on add logo and you could add your logo real quick now you will see your phone number and all of that and you can also set up your opening hours so you can edit your opening hours right here by simply tapping on it and from there you can edit your opening hours and if you would like to add interval you can simply tap on add interval right there once everything is to your liking, you can also customize the message field so you could type in a message if you want. And if you would like your customers to be able to add photos, you can toggle on add photos. And to preview it, we'll tap on preview right here to see how it will look. So you can see your link right here at the top which you can copy the URL. And this is how your page will look. So all a customer will have to do once they come onto your page, they can simply tap on book now. And once they tap on book now, they would see your services, but we would have to finish setting it up. So you can see right there services, then they can select the service. So let's say for example, haircut, they would tap on that and then they would continue the setup. But we would need to enable it so we would have to tap on save and publish for them to be able to do that but we'll go over to the left hand menu option once more and from there you can set up payments so you can tap on that and if you would like to start collecting payments you could tap on start now and then you'll be able to use the hey goldie platform to collect payments now if you would like to add team members and so on you can tap on staff and from here you'll be able to add staff by simply tapping on add staff and this is offered on the paid plan now that you have done all of that all you'll need to do now is simply go back right here we're going to tap on online booking after we have selected online booking we are going to tap on activate online booking continue then we're going to tap on save and publish now that you have selected save and publish your link will now be live as you can see right there change is saved just give it a few seconds and you can see right there it is now active so all you will need to do you can tap on copy link and you will now be able to share your link you can also add social media buttons if you want so for example if i were to tap on the link right now and tap on book now or tap on services so if i were to tap on book now you can see the services right here then i can select the service then you can select whether it is one or two after you have done that you will see the price you can tap on continue after you have tapped on continue you can choose the day that you would like to book it once you have selected the day you can select the time then they will tap on continue right here after you have tapped on continue you can see it will hold this slot for 10 minutes you are going to need to fill in your name phone number email address and then you will simply tap on complete booking after you have tapped on complete booking the customer will receive a message that it has been set up that their booking has been confirmed 
and that is how hey goldie works and if you would like access to other features in which you'll be able to automate their reminders and so on as i said earlier to do that you will need to go onto their paid plan but you can also set up reminders so that your customers will be reminded of when they will be having their appointment and that's it hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and thank you for watching